Hello, this is IPSer, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. Alright, so here's the off-screen work I did. I did a quite good level grinding, actually. Edge is 36, she knows Cure 4, and Rydia knows some level 3 black magic spells, so... Yeah, we're good. Actually, she knows the spells. Actually, she needs one more spell. Like, I want her to have bolt 3 before we tackle that one dungeon after this, so... Yeah. Okay, so, every, there's little green dots in here, which do damage to you as you step on them, so float, of course, will override that. So, these things right here, yeah, we're walking over them, not taking nothing, but if you didn't have float on, you wouldn't have it. So, every floor, you want to want to reestablish float. Yeah, it can get annoying, but, yeah, just do it. Say, okay, so here's the mall ball, or mall, marlo, whatever you want to call them, these guys. Use the breath command or bad breath, which pretty much inflicts every status element in the book. Now, in the old version, it's bugged because if you're immune to at least one of those status elements, um, none of them work. But of course, like with the ruby ring or the rune ring, but Edge doesn't have any of those, so him and Kane, I think, is the only ones that will be able to be afflicted by that breath. So Cecil, Lydia, and um. Rosa are safe. Yeah, but nothing a heal can't take care of. Heal just goes ahead and wipes out all of them. Yeah, I like how on this game they don't have like antidotes or anything. They just have heals, which removes every status element. So I like that. Yeah, and as you can see, I don't have the bow equipped because whenever I was recording this, I unequipped it so I wouldn't run out of my arrows while grinding. And then I forgot to equip it back. So, um,. Well, I'll tell you, I'll go ahead and tell you in this dungeon. Oh crap, I forgot to reestablish it. Oh well, well, before we go anything else, let's go to this store. I'll just take the. I'll just take it. Take it like a man. Yeah, so, um, let's reestablish. Let, reestablish. Uh, put it back on. Yeah. Okay, so. Let's keep going. Um, this place is really quite boring. Yeah. Okay, so here we get the heal, another heal. Yeah, they throw those at you like lore. And over here we get the we get the charm rod, a really good rod for Rydia. Yep, really really good. Mhm. Mm so we're gonna definitely. That's why I didn't buy anything like the chain went back for her back at that one village because we would have just ended up getting rid of it for this anyway. Because the chain went may have more attack power, but this is way more superior. Anyway, it pretty much makes it to where you can see the passages now. I don't even know. How does he at 1 HP? Edge, what the heck happened? What? He's not even down and hurt. I don't understand what's going on. No, not at all. What the heck? Usually they're bent down and hurting. Edge, what the? I guess that's a bug or a glitch or something. Why isn't he down? Oh well. Well, maybe he doesn't get down if you're in float. Well, I, then again, I think he does. Eh. So anyway, let's head up here. We got more crap. Battles! Alright, so here we get the um, toad lady and tiny toads. Now, the tiny toads can afflict the toad status on you. And then, once you kill them, she can turn herself into a toad. And once she does that, she can cast toad on you. So apparently in this game, enemy toads can turn you into a toad. But when you're a toad, you can't do nothing but sit there and look cute. Because toads aren't cute, what am I saying? Anyway, um, as you can see here, we clearly only have five more spells in the game for Rosa. Yeah, and, um, I know a few of them. I know all of them, actually, but, yeah, be looking forward to them. Crap, back attack, get out of here. Get out of there. Crap, that's the annoying thing. They have like the toad status, and it's really annoying. Whenever you have the toad status, Cecil can't use any magic, but heal. Explain, please. Why? <laughs> that doesn't make sense. You know, that makes Cecil a paladin, the whole big concept of using white magic. Yet, yeah, you see the white magic he has? I do believe he gets no other white magic, if not one more. Yeah, that's it for Cecil, though. Just cure two. This is the best cure spell he gets. Ridiculous. And we already have the best cure spell. Yeah. Best cure spell in the game. With Rosa there, so... Yeah. Okay, let's 
get a cure two there. Get a cure three. Here we get a heal. Why does that just stack on the other one I have? God. Jesus Christ, this is annoying. Annoying, so annoying. I'm sorry, I did not sell crap. I'm gonna have to do that. Why do I keep forgetting? Anyway, yeah, oh, and um, I got all the diamond gear on Cecil and um, Kane there. Yeah, all the diamond stuff I need, so. I thought it would take much longer than that, but no. Once I got- this is the level I was wanting to get to anyway, and once I got here, I had enough money to, like, get by the town, so... Yeah, I think there's a passage over here. And a random battle against the ghosts. They absorb fire. And there's pretty much- I just ran because Kane died, so I'm just gonna bring him back to life. Yeah, yeah, of course, I have no lives. Oh, come on, what is my luck? Really? Come on, game. Really? Jesus Christ. Game. This game hates me. God, come on! Cure 4. There. Cure 4, like, is awesome, man. Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. One step. Really? Don't act like your sequel, Final Fantasy 4. Yeah, I tried to play Final Fantasy 4 the after years late earlier, and I could not due to the frustration of a battle every three friggin' steps. Yeah, we get monsters in this chest, and every chest here has monsters. This is a really secret room with really good treasure in it. Not joking. Really good. Yeah. So I'm gonna fast forward through this battle. Uh, you know, one Shiva should take them out. Yeah. These things are weak to ice, so it'd be pretty easy. Alright. Okay, good girl, Rydia. Okay, we get an elixir there. Now, in the um, original version, you'd get a blue fang or a red fang. Anyway, here we'd get all of those, and they'd cast like fire three, bolt three, and ice three. Yeah, but again, in this version of the game, for some reason, in the American version, they don't ever have those. Why? I don't know. Because Final Fantasy IV, aka Final Fantasy II, in the Americas, retarded and doesn't want to do anything. God. Eh. So. The tree guys take good damage to the fire, so... Yeah, and they're using Berserk on Marvelous. Thank you. Yeah. I love how they got the name Marvel. They got it... It's all a smoky creature. And they got it from that cigarette. I like that. I think it's hilarious. Anyway, we get the full moon boomerang. With... Superior to his old one that we got back at, um... Eblon. Um, hideout. Yeah. It is really good. It... For sure replaces the middle one of the middle blades. Yeah, so um look at his attack power now. Yeah. Yeah, skyrockets. He should be uh, Cecil and Kane should be trailing him now. I told you Edge would get awesome in this game. People actually say that he sucks in the um original version and is good in the DS version. When I Personally, no offense to anybody if you think differently. I think it's the other way around. I think he's good in this version, but not too good in the DS version. Because in the DS version, his weak defense is just horrible. He dies, like, so easy. I know he did at first here, but he's getting better. Yeah, so, um, let's open this. Kill these guys. Get this out of the way if they'll ever die. Okay. What am I doing? I'm just going to use an elixir on Kane and get him healed. I don't feel like doing anything else. Yeah. Not at all. Okay, so we use that. Elixir, okay. Okay, um. More marbles. Um. Let's take him out then. Yeah. These guys take a while to kill. I am sorry. About you having the bad breath status, Kane. I'm so sorry. Now, I hope we get the sword I've been wanting from this guy. Yeah, I really do. Oh, it's gonna be perfect. Yeah. Okay, get him. Yeah. Silenced. Oh, that does nothing. <laughs> Alright, we got him. The two marbles. Okay, so let's see what we get for our hard work. Alright, the Avenger sword. The mighty handed sword. That's right. It requires two hands to hold that bad baby. So, of course, you're not going to be able to select it here. See? 
So you're gonna have to take off your shield and then do it. Wait a minute. You're kidding me! I don't have a slot to take off my shield? That's ridiculous! God, I'm just gonna have to use like a heal on somebody and get it out of the way. God, I'm gonna definitely have to sell stuff off screen. So, yeah, what you have to do is remove this and equip it. The Avenger Sword is ridiculously good. Now, I may not have as much damage as Edge, but it's gonna do better because it puts Auto Berserk on your character. So, he's gonna be dealing near 2k damage, which 2k means 2000 if you ever played World of Warcraft, which is referred to pretty much instead of 1000. If you call it 2000, then you're a noob on the game. I hate, crit I hate critical people. <laughs> anyway, yeah, Cecil, you'll never have to come digital with him with the Avenger Sword, so he should be able to pwn everybody now, pretty much. Yeah. Flood does pretty good damage against them. Yeah, I decided to put um, Kane, um, Edge's ninja ability kind of to use. Not completely to use. Okay, we get another elixir there. Okay, so he seems so that we have the final chest and running out of the center. What the heck? One of these guys at the beginning of the- WHAT?! Edge! What? How did that happen?! What?! Well, anyway, we get Medusa arrows. I really do not know how Edge just dropped dead there. Let's bring him back to life. Ugh. And cure for everybody. Oh my god. Well, I'm running out of time, so I guess this has been IPSer with Let's Play Final Fantasy 4. And um, I'll see you all next time. Um, again, this is IPSer Production, and I'll see you all next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy 4. IPSer1234, signing out. Have a nice day, guys. Bye.